this particular exhibit uh, is groundbreaking in many ways. This is the first time of the year. ウィリアム・ファーカーっていうイギリス人の、まあ、こ,こ,のこの場所の当時のこの場所の総督が、えーまあ、こ,のこの場所の、まあ、自然だったり動植物に、まあ、非常に感動してどうしてもこのものを、まあ、残そうということでここにいた中国人のアーティストたちと一緒に、えーまあ、記録していった絵が元になっていてその絵自体もこのナショナル・ミュージアムがコレクションしてるんだけども。その絵をもとに作った、えー、作品です。Basically, there are four parties involved: National Museum being the client, Teamlab being the digital content developers, Panasonic, and also broadcast professional who are working closely together. This is by far the largest dome installation in museum using 6,500 lumen laser projector. A total of 59 units of RZ670 are being installed in National Museum of Singapore. 17 units for the dome and 42 units for the corridor. RZ670 is a one chip DLP laser projector with 6,500 lumen brightness, 10,000 to 1 contrast, and it is maintenance free up to 20,000 hours. That's why it is very suitable in such dome installation. As both spaces of the corridor and the drum revolve around spatial projection due to the curvatures in the drum and the inclination of the corridor space, Panasonic laser projectors pulled out immediately due to their angle free installation possibilities, which made the projector alignment simple to manage. The distance from corridor to screen is different at each point. It is difficult to find the correct mounting position for each projector. We have used our own Panasonic simulation software to simulate the actual site condition and have done a lot of site survey before deciding the mounting position. Inside the original dorm, Inside this space, we need to put the projectors facing each other. If they made a lot of clearances between each screen, which is called the branding edge, they show the white pattern on the screen. The RZ670 is a laser projector, which shows black screen very clearly. So it really shows and supports dark black ground very well in this space. We've had a wonderful response from our visitors. A lot of them really understand where we're coming from in trying to bring the collection to life. And working with a collection like this, it's really important for them to、uh, see it at a technological level, at an artistic level. It allows our visitors to interact,、uh, not just view, making it an immersive environment for our visitors to enjoy. It's surreal, it's magical, and beautiful. I think beyond the colors,、uh, it tells a story. I like the whole thing. I like the part when it rained because it really, well, it reminds me of my childhood. えっとこれ自分のスマートフォンを持ってこの回廊を歩いていくんだけども、近くに出現したものを写真を撮ることで見つけたものをコレクションしていって自分の図鑑ができていく。でその図鑑の中は、えー、いろんな動物の特徴が学べるっていう。それがすごく特徴的だと思います。We wanted to really bring to life this collection to our visitors today, and bringing in technology,、uh, working with partners such as TMAP, the artists,、uh, as well as Panasonic, Broadcast Pro. The Panasonic team are amazing, very amazing. They always work so fast, accurate, and very inspiring. We really appreciate them for all the hard work and thank them for making all this happen. Panasonic.